A different African leader, same quote, former Ivory Coast President Loro Bagbo, who is at the moment detained at The Hague in the Netherlands, is expected to appear before the International Criminal Court to face charges of crimes against humanity. After over 3,000 people were killed and more than a million others displaced in a four-month civil war in Ivory Coast after Loro Bagbo refused to concede defeat and give up power to Alsani Ouattara in last year's election. Despite the uncertified results showing that Ouattara had won the election, his rival declined to concede and it is the disputed poll that led to Bagbo's forces and allied militia to attack suspected Ouattara supporters. 66-year-old Bagbo was taken by helicopter on Tuesday from remote Korogo in northern Ivory Coast, where he had been under house arrest since his capture and put on a plane to Netherlands where he was driven to the detention center in The Hague. The arrest warrant is said to have been issued secretly only in the presence of his lawyers. ICC prosecutor Luis Moreno Campo visited the country in mid-October as part of the inquiry, assuring Ivorians that his investigation would be impartial. According to Campo, Bagbo is likely to be joined by other high-level suspects from both sides of the conflict. Judy Kosge, Citizen Live at Nine.